two days after Shahrukh came to stay with me, we were having dinner in Churchgate in a restaurant called the Gaylord Restaurant. And as we were sitting and eating dinner, he finally looked at me and said to me straight, my mother is dying. Now, I didn't know how to handle that. So I said, what? He said, my mother's in Delhi. She's in hospital right now. There seems to be some sort of a multiple organ failure. She's in a coma and she won't last long. He told me how his father died. He told me how his mother had brought him and his sister up. He told me how brave his mother had been in trying to give him the best of everything. And he also told me how much his mother wanted him to become the biggest superstar in the country. And yet, because Gauri did not want him to be a film star, he was not acting. A few days later, he went back to Delhi and that became a certain pattern. He would go back to Delhi for four or five days to be with his mother and then he would come back from Delhi. He always gave me reports about his mother. She was not getting better. She was more or less in the same condition and uh, she was in a coma. Sometimes she would have some lucid moments but otherwise she was not in a good shape at all. Uh, we tried everything we could for his mother, uh, but we could not save her. And he called up from Delhi after his mother died and he told me that his mother had died. Uh, it took two or three days for him to finish with the death formalities and the paperwork, uh, the burial. And uh, without telling me this time, so that I didn't go to the airport, he just got a flight from Delhi, came back to Bombay. And I opened the door and there he was standing outside and said, I want to do movies. So I said, okay, come in, uh, you know, uh, but he didn't come in the house. He said, no, I want to do movies and either you're going to help me to do movies or I'm not coming into your house. I'll stay on the road and I'll figure out to do movies. So I said, you're talking like an ass. I've always told you to do movies. You're the one who's been saying no and uh, come in and uh, we'll make a movie. He said, you're sure you'll make a movie for me? I said, I'm sure I'll make a movie for you. So we decided that we would make a film and that I would produce it and uh, I would choose whichever director he wanted to work with. But there were other dark clouds that were hovering. Uh, Anant Balani wanted to make a film with Salman uh, and was very clear with me and said Vivek you and me have been in school together, we've made Gawahi together, then we made a big Patthar Ke Pool and Salman is now a huge, huge film star. I talked to Kundan Shah as well and Kundan said Vivek I wish I had your courage, I don't have courage. My producer, and I have producers, uh, want me to make a film. Uh, incidentally, that was Kabhi Haan Kabhi Na. But they don't want me to work with a newcomer. They want me to work with a star, so I'm going to Amir Khan with this film. And I realized that even though I had already made a successful Patthar Ke Pool, uh, I was not big enough, or maybe strong enough, or maybe powerful enough as a producer to make a film uh, and launch a banner and launch an act. So with this in mind, I went to Mr. G.P. Sippy and I said, Sippy Saab, we've already made a successful Patthar Ke Pool, uh, you know, and uh, I would like to make another film with you. He said, that's wonderful. Uh, we have Anand Balani signed for the next film and your assistant, uh, erstwhile Sanjay Gupta, has got a great script and Sanjay Gupta says that he will get us Sanjay Dutt and uh, so on and so forth. And uh, you can make both the movies. So I said, yeah, I can make both the movies, but I want to make a film with Shah Rukh Khan. So GPCP said, but who is Shah Rukh Khan? I said, no, no, he works on television. So he says, uh, you want to, after Patthar Ke Pool, which is now celebrating its 100th glorious day at the Novelty Cinema, after doing this, you want to make a film with a TV star. TV stars don't become stars. We can't make this film with this Shah Rukh Khan.